mudslide kills 600 religious pilgrims. And yet both my ex-wives live on. <laughs> Morning. Morning. Uh-oh. Not again. Please, not again. Thank God. <laughs> Always in the last place you look, huh? Uh-huh. Have a nice day. You too. Yeah, Phil, it's Charlie. Put me down for a grand on Detroit tonight. What's the line now? Well, excuse me, but don't you think if the gambler is awake, it behooves the bookie to be up as well? <laughs> All right, well, call me when you get off the can. Are you aware that your sleepover buddy was packing heat? Oh, yeah. Any hotter and she'd have burned my pubes clean off. Charlie, a gun in the house? Relax, she's a cop. Or was a cop. Or is wanted by the cops. I know we should mention cops. Unbelievable. So, so this was another one night stand? Unless she comes back for her handcuffs, yeah. Boy, how much satisfaction can you get from that? Handcuffs? Not really my thing. But hey, she probably did some stuff last night that might not have been her first choice. No, I, I mean, how can you possibly get any satisfaction from an endless series of alcohol-soaked one-night stands? And even as the words are coming out of my mouth, I realize it's a stupid question, so forget I said it. <laughs> She's married to a cop. <laughs> well, I, I hate to see you wasting your life having drunken sex with women you don't care about. Who asked you to move back in and watch? You know who's good for you? Don't go there, Alan. M Mia. She was beautiful, she was smart, she got you to clean up your act. I'm telling you, Charlie, letting her go was the stupidest thing you've ever done. You're going there, Alan. I'm just saying you had this fantastic woman who was willing to marry you, and, and you just threw it away. And, and for what? Okay. You're there. <laughs> you want to know why I gave up Mia? I'll tell you why I gave up Mia. I gave her up for you. Oh, oh, for me? Yeah, yeah, for you. She wanted you to move out so we'd have the house to ourselves, but I said, no way. I am not throwing my brother out on the street. Wow. What a loving gesture. Don't bite me. <laughs> and you know what you did? You married Candy and moved out anyway. So if you want to know why I let the best thing that ever happened to me get away, it's so the worst thing that could ever happen to me would have a place to live. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh. Well, I, I guess it all worked out for the best, huh? How do you figure? Well, think about it. If Mia had been living here when Candy kicked me out and I came back, it would have been a very awkward situation. Word. <laughs> 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 <laughs>